Um, I need to chuck in a little bottle emptier in here so that we can empty those bottles of dirty water eventually. But they're not quite ready to do that. Um, this one, I'm going to put it just like that. Otherwise, they're going to be washing their hands going in and out. Which is a little bit of overkill. Please, can we get some seeds? No seeds. Dang. How are we going with dirt? 175 tons of dirt. Okay. We probably won't run out of that soon. As for oxygen, though. Let's have a quick look. Oxygen diffuser, algae, consumes algae. Okay, we don't have any algae, obviously. Let's take a quick look at base oxygen generation. Added 19, removed 117. <laughs> so we're losing 100 kilos. Trivaldo, why are you breathing so much? <laughs> what? Okay. Hmm. I mean, I have rust. I could use that. Potentially. Alright, here we go. So, I could get the rust. The oxidizer converts rust into oxygen and chlorine, though. Hmm. Chlorine, at least, it goes underneath the, I don't know. I guess we're going to have to get that because it's either chlorine or hydrogen. Chlorine at least goes down. Hydrogen goes up. So these don't really produce that much. Hmm. I can grow them myself. Then they need water. That kind of sucks. So they're, they're not really viable unless you mass produce them. And by the time that you mass produce them, then you, it's too late anyway. Oh, there's a mealwood there. Let's grab that. Good, we got another seed. We're getting close. We have about 20 now. Almost. That's pretty good. So 20 times 6 is 12,000 calories. Um, yeah, it's not bad. Alright, so let's make an area for the rust thing. Well, we'll dig out all this place because we're going to need to do that anyway at some point. Put that there. Hello? Was that the rust thing? It was. Cool. So let's take a look at this. Rust deoxidizer. Yeah, it converts rust into oxygen and chlorine. Does it have an output though? It does not, so it just goes into the into the atmosphere, basically. But oxygen it produces 570 grams per second. 570. As for the dupes, uh, so they inhale 100, so 400, and yeah, okay. So if we produce 570. Lose 400, so we can have 5.7 dupes if we have this rust thing. How much rust does it need? 450 grams. It needs salt? What? And power, obviously. Salt? The heck? What does salt count as? Rust. We have a thousand. That's not that much. We have rust here that we can grab. Do we have salt? There's salt in there. 
Ah, uh, okay. It doesn't use that much salt though. And then of course we have the electrolyzer, which uses a shitload of water. But it produces slightly more oxygen as well. And heat. 1.13 compared to 1.25, so this produces more heat. Okay. 150 grams per second of salt. That's not that bad. Alright, well, let's build one. We'll just put it like here. I want to see how it works. Did I end up getting the airflow tiles? No. Let's get those now. Where are they? Air. There we are. Needs power. Let's do this properly now. Hide those wires. Hide your shame. Good. No wire connected. Rust. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So now we just need salt. I could get, grab some salt from there. It's not grown though. Oh no, look at that. So if you want to grow it yourself, you need sand. <laughs> and I just explained how we don't have any sand here. Bastards. They, they know what they're doing. They know exactly what you need and they do not give it to you. That's okay. That's what makes this game challenging. There's a pip egg. Did we end up getting the food egg cracker? No, we didn't get it yet. Okay. Well, we're slowly getting towards this salt. We will get there. We'll get it. Just down here. Gotta go through this mafic rock. It's funny because... When mafic rock was at the surface, it was like incredibly hot. Yet here, it's very cold. Five. Salt is very soft, apparently. Although rust is firm. That's firm. Okay. Well, we need a ladder to get down there. So. Let's go like that. Let's get this salt. Maybe we'll give it a bit of a higher priority because it's relatively important. <laughs> And this, we will disable that for now. Who did what? Research, okay. Ah, uh, what do we want? What do we want? I can make like a microbe musher or whatever and get food that way if I wanted to. But I think they're doing okay. Yeah, we're not really at panic stations just yet. We've got some food coming through. We'll be okay, I think. Alright, so now that that is turned off, we want polluted water coming through here. Cool. <laughs> they need to breathe. Of course. Airflow tiles, here we go. Okay. Uh... Let's go like... Let's go like that. I always do like something in the middle. I want to try something a little bit different this time. We'll just do like... The inner... <laughs> the inner sanctum. Because this is going to be spitting out the oxygen anyway. So we'll have things around there. That's a lot of metal though. Oh, we've got seven tons now. Okay. Fair enough. Carry on then. <laughs> Look at all these things that we got. Manual airlock. We don't need that just yet. We've got a supercomputer. That will come in handy. Let's put that down here maybe. 
And we'll get rid of these wires. Don't need those. Please be something good. Oh! One fungal spore. <laughs> Just one? Eh, I'll take it. Oh, that's one thing we need. We need some storage. All right, that'll do for now. Go to bed, everyone. Research. Got a squint. It's like it's when you zoom in, it's too big, and when you zoom out, it's too small. <laughs> there's just there's no good middle ground here. Uh, maybe we'll go for this. Or do I want to get what is this wall pot? Okay, yeah, they had those before. You gotta go all the way to this. What? Yeah, we'll go for it. Furniture. Got a mess table so they can actually eat. Nice. Starvation. Oopsie. Harold. How low are you, Harold? Okay, he's still got quite a bit to go. There you go, food right there for you, Harold. <laughs> I mean, once all of these grow, we'll be fine. We will be fine. Get that salt. And anyone can dig the salt, which is nice. There you go, salt! That's so cool. I was trying to think of what they could possibly include in like the new biomes. I never would have guessed like a salt rust biome. <laughs> Who comes up with that stuff? That's amazing. All right, we're almost done here. We can almost turn on these toilets. Starvation, who is it now? Nails, nails. Oh, so when they get under a thousand, but this is 94. Five, 99%, okay. Look at this go. That's cool. <laughs> I don't know what that is or what it's doing, but I like it. So it is, you can see it's making some chlorine, but that will go down. It'll just come on, sit all in here, which is fine. Chlorine is probably the one gas that is not that bad because like you can't breathe it in, but it sterilizes everything. So, you know, it's germ free You can actually. All right. Uh, what don't we want? We don't want eggs. We don't want polluted dirt. Is that it? I think that's about it. Agriculture. Yeah, that's fine. Good. So that'll keep everyone very busy now. Attribute increase. Skill points. Nice. Alright, let's dish out some of these skill points. Travaldo. Good stuff. Um, This, that would still be fine for you. Better researcher. Mima. Yeah, might as well. So, you only have... Wait, what? Oh, I get... because it's something that she loves, she gets another morale for it. That's nice. Okay, well, we can do that too then. Does that mean you get a better hat? No. When do you get a better hat? <laughs> oh, you can be a field researcher. Why don't you get a better hat? Oh, now you do. Okay. Very nice. Woohoo! 
Yay! Everyone claps. Oh, they go to the portal to do it now. <laughs> I can't wait to get rid of that. I'm also going to put one here. That will be the polluted stuff. Good, good, good. You know what? Let's try to speed this up a little bit, yeah? Because it's taking a little bit longer than I would have liked. I kind of... You know, it's already cycle 13 and we don't have just the basics of a decent toilet for everyone, you know? That, that stuff is pretty important. Let's see if we can find any of those... Ah, oh, here we go. Got a geyser over there. It's actually quite close. We could even jump in there and see what it is. Hmm. Do we have any others? I'm just having a quick look. I might even miss them. I'm not sure. But... Because you can tell by the little green... The neutronium. I think that's all that we can see right now. So yeah, hurry up and do that. Where was it again? Here it is. Okay. We can totally have a look at what's in there. Just jump down there. Make a little tile here. Ah. Ah, oh, we can't even dig that. No. What is this? Obsidian. You can't dig obsidian? Okay. Well, we can do that. That should be good enough to see what it is. Hopefully. And this is going to be organic polluted dirt. All right, see, look, now we got some food coming in. Some more seeds. Fantastic. Now we need to connect up that computer. Cool. I like it. Uh, more skill points. Great. Who's got a skill point now? Harold. Harold, Mr. Farmer. Well, you love farming so much that I might just give you a little promotion. Then you should be able to become a crop tender. <laughs> like a chicken tender except for crops. All right. Good. In fact, this chlorine might actually be a blessing in disguise because it's going to end up sitting all around this polluted water. <laughs> so that's actually perfect. I like this base so far. More skill points? No. Alrighty guys, I'm going to have to leave it there for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed that episode. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you would like some more oxygen not included. I will see you guys next time. Take care.